with a look at a health topic that's on the minds of our friends and family. Mm -hmm. Here's the question, Dr. Jen. When it comes to consuming protein, how much is too much and can you overdo it? Okay, so I love this question, you guys. You absolutely can overdo it like anything in nutrition or medicine. Just because some is good doesn't mean a lot or too much is even better. Um, so get out your pens, get out your calculators. We have to do some simple math here. I'm gonna walk you through the equation for how we determine protein requirements. Take your weight in pounds, divide it by 2.2. That's going to give you your weight in kilograms. And then you multiply that number by about 1.2. Now the range is 1.0 up to potentially 2.0, but 1.2 is a good middle ground. That will give you the number of grams per day that you should be taking in for a moderate to slightly high protein intake. Intake, this obviously depends on your body weight. It depends on your activity level. It depends on possibly, um, you know, whether you're an athlete or someone who's older or pregnant. But this will get you around 50 to 70 grams of protein a day, you guys. That's hard to get, actually. So um, I love to, you know, get out the phone, do some math, and then read those labels with what you're eating. Thank goodness for calculators. Mm -hmm. All right, <laughs> let's talk about your prescription for wellness. All right, you guys, well, you know I love coffee, and caffeine in coffee can have some real health benefits, but not if you dump a ton of sugar um, and sweeteners in it. So for some spice tip swaps um, that may ha also have some health benefits, cinnamon in your coffee, that can help to stabilize blood pressure, um, and you can whip it up so that it's nicely blended. Nutmeg is a good source of an ingredient called manganese. That's an element which can help with bone health. And then cardamom uh, will give you a boost of vitamin C, potassium, and zinc. All of those things kind of good. And again, it takes time, you guys, to retrain your taste buds. So don't give up. Don't expect to see um, an, an effect right away. But try to lower the amount of sugar and boost those spices. All right, we're listening. And you can send your questions to Dr. <laughs> Jed on Instagram at ABCGMA3. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.